pilots come in from all over the world for balloon fiesta, but thieves aren't making Albuquerque look very good right now. Another balloonist had his trailer stolen overnight, the second stolen since fiesta started. News 13's Catherine Mazzone reports. The door is actually torn apart. Balloon pilot Chuck Danley takes a look at what thieves left behind. His truck and trailer were stolen sometime last night from the Staybridge Suites parking lot near San Pedro and Alameda. Crap. <laughs> I mean, an empty feeling inside that I'm not going to get to fly. But Danley is one of the lucky ones. APD found his trailer in downtown Albuquerque near Rio Grande and I-40, ransacked, but mostly intact. I felt rel some relief that something was found. Um, I would have liked to have found all of it. Danley's burners, gondola, and envelope were all recovered in his trailer, but he can't fly. All of his flight instruments were in his truck. Danley says it's $1,600 he's willing to spend in order to fly this week. He says he has bigger concerns. We heard of, of at least one other, possibly two other that were also trying to be stolen. And they're not the only ones. It was a very special balloon. Lucinda and Marilyn Wallace had their trailer and truck stolen Saturday with an heirloom balloon inside. It belonged to Lucinda's late husband, and it's still missing. Danley thinks something needs to be done. We need to work together to, to do something that, that we can minimize this in the future so that we, this event doesn't have a blemish on it and the town of Albuquerque doesn't have a blemish on it. The first step is making sure that uh, you know, everybody keeps an eye out for everybody else's stuff. Fiesta reps say they tell pilots to take precautions, keeping valuables out of sight and parking in lit areas. But other balloonists have their own ideas. It's a white and pink trailer. Uh, it's hard to miss, you know what I mean? Like marking your trailer, letting crooks know what's inside. There's nothing they can do with it because it's registered, has serial numbers and everything on it. Regardless of what happens to his truck and instruments, Danley's dedicated to the fiesta. I'm going to come back. Uh, it, this doesn't scare me away. Catherine Mazzone, KRQE News 13. Danley's truck is still missing and he says he has no way to tow his trailer back to Colorado. We asked Balloon Fiesta about some of the ideas that pilots had to stop theft, like LoJack, a GPS tracking device. Fiesta reps say it is something they would consider, but they say it won't stop crime, it will just track it. We also questioned why there is no designated place for pilots to keep their trailers. Fiesta says they offered a fenced-in area with security two years ago, but no one took advantage of it.